everyone, today is Sunday now and I'm going to Little Tokyo today. It is the opening ceremony for Nisei Week, which is a Japanese cultural festival in downtown Los Angeles in Little Tokyo. I'll leave a link in the description box below if you want to find out more information about Nisei Week. But basically every year they crown a queen and court to represent the Japanese American community. And last year, my cousin Jamie actually won queen. So today for the opening ceremonies this this year she's actually going to be emceeing the event so my mom and I are going to go over there give her some support and then hopefully grab some food in little Tokyo because I'm already hungry and I definitely need to grab a snack or something before we leave because I have no idea how long this opening ceremony is or anything like that but I'm really looking forward to seeing my cousin just kill it on the stage. If you want to know what it's like inside Janim or the Japanese American National Museum I did film a video there showing you what it's like to visit so I'll leave a link to that video down in the description box below for you guys. Picked up some mochi, the green one, and then I also got oh, pink mochi. So good. And with mama. All right, let's go. Let's go, <laughs> little Tokyo. Little Tokyo, here we come. <laughs> So good. We just got out of the opening ceremony for Nisei Week in Janum, so we just popped on over to the uh, tea place. Gonna get afternoon tea service for both of us, because I've never had it before. Oh my. This is my tea, the lychee blooming tea. Full bloom. I'm like straight up sweating right now. I'm finally getting my couch delivered today. So I have been moving boxes and unpacking and this is what my living room looks like right now. Ah, it's an open space waiting for my new couch. I'm so excited. It's just been like very empty. So I'm excited to finally get that in so that I can watch some TV and chill. So, whew. And yeah, it's like a mess over here because I tried moving everything over. And then this is the living room or whatever table that goes right there. That glass, holy mamas, so freaking heavy. It's cute, but it's heavy. So yay, I'm excited. So hopefully I think the next time I check in with you guys, it'll be here. Oh yeah, the new couch is in. Mom's enjoying it. Ah, so nice. It actually makes, this view is nice. This is the view. Do you like it, Mom? I love it. <laughs> I'm gonna come visit all the time. Oh, great. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so happy to finally have a couch. Me too. I can just finally just chill and watch TV. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> okay, well. Anyways. <laughs> All right, my mom and I are in Manhattan Beach right now. We're picking up a cake for my dad. We're having a going away dinner for him. So we're picking up some dessert.
to Target. Running a lot of errands together. Got some new blankets for the couch. It's really neat to go like this, but yeah. Very happy. And then we also got this one. This one ended up being originally $30, but then it was on sale for nine. So nine. And then that was also on sale for 25% off at Target. So that really worked out well, but uh, you guys, it feels so nice to finally have my couch. My place finally feels like it's a little bit more moved in than before. Having the couch come in really forced me to kind of like unpack boxes and move things into my bedroom, which actually, I don't know if I showed you, but I, to make room, I finally, like I had all those boxes there, right? So I ended up taking out my books. So. This is my bookshelf now. <laughs> and then I also got these like space saver things for my closet. So I started doing that yesterday, put out my shoe shelf. So I need to buy more shelving and stuff for here, but it's at least starting to come along just like a little bit. Um, but I'm most proud of my bookshelf which is finally unpacked. So I'm feeling good about that. Slowly but surely coming together, you guys. Sorry, I'm like very shiny because it is so warm today in LA. But yeah, I'm just feeling so grateful to like finally have my couch here and just this apartment is slowly but surely coming together and I'm just like, it's like every time I walk into this room and see my couch, I get so much joy and happiness from it because just without it, I would just like didn't really have a place to just like chill and relax. And now that this guy is here, it just completes the home and the like, I don't know, it feels like a sanctuary here for me now. And yeah, just feeling really grateful for everything, you guys. Um... Yeah, so it's about six o'clock right now. So I'm gonna eat some dinner right now and then I am going to edit my video that goes live on Sunday because tomorrow is gonna be a day where my dad actually comes over. He's, I'm gonna help him with his website a little bit. And then my mom, Randall and I are gonna take him out to a nice dinner, um, a nice going away dinner because um, my dad's actually gonna go to Japan for three months. My dad is planning to move out there. So this trip that he's going on, he is actually gonna be looking for a place to live. So, well, I don't know if you guys have seen my moving vlog, but um, I kind of talked about how, you know, that was the first time that all four of us have really spent a lot of quality time together. I mean, it was like six, seven days straight of each other, which is just like, I don't know, we had a lot of time to really bond. And then after that, it was the first year I ever had a joint Father's Day with my dad and Randall, which was just super special. It's something that I have wanted to do for a while has been to host a joint family dinner at my place. But at my old apartment it just like I didn't have the space for it and I don't know I just feel like the family relationship was a little bit different then but you know after the seven days of really kind of having to be together a little bit and moving me into this new place it just really bonded our family and like my dad and Randall are close and like it's just a d very different relationship now because of that and I'm just yeah all good things like this new chapter in my life has just been a really really great one so far um but yeah anyway so tomorrow's gonna be really special we're gonna go to this restaurant restoration kitchen and wine bar it's in old town torrance and i actually haven't been there in a couple of years since covid but every time that i've been to this place the menu is just it's so good and they have a great selection of wine there so i'm excited to go there again finally yeah i'll make sure to leave a link in the description to the restaurant that we're going to i try to do that for every vlog as i try to leave links to all the places that we go just so you can find it so if you're ever curious about where we ate or any places that i've explored i usually leave a link in the description and if i forgot to leave a link you can just let me know in the comments and i will send you the link to the place that we go to all right well, I am starving now, so I'm going to eat and I will check in with you tomorrow. Yeah, I'm, I'm only editing today, so it's not going to be that exciting. So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> going to his going away dinner. <laughs> Yeah, so.
some cake. Oh, looks so good. Strawberry cheesecake, white cake, chocolate cake with the berries, and then this one is carrot cake. It is the next day. Yesterday, I went to dinner with my parents and we went to Restoration Wine and Kitchen in Old Town Torrance and it was so good. Sorry, my hair is like all over the place right now. But yeah, it was a really good night. Very, very nice uh, dinner with them. So uh, today it is 11.18 right now. Um, my cousins are coming over, my cousins Jamie and Heather. We're just gonna have a girls lunch. They're actually gonna pick up Spoon House, which is this Japanese Italian place in Gardena. I'll leave a link in the description to both of the restaurants that I went to because they're both so good. Spoon House is known for their really unique spaghetti flavor. So they're gonna come over to my apartment because it's gonna be the first time that they've ever seen my place I will show you what I get because the spaghetti that I ordered is the uh, Natto shiso natto is this like fermented bean that not everybody likes I really love it. It's really healthy for you But the smell is very distinct and it's like this like sticky consistency But if you've grown up with it, it's just I don't know. I personally think it's the best I love getting like natto sushis and stuff like that, but all right. Well, I'll see you when they get here. Ooh. Okay, so natto shiso. Yum. Hot garlic. Hot garlic. Wait, is that all garlic on the top right it's there? It's like mushrooms. And okay. daikon. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, well. <laughs> Isn't this pretty? This is the fiddle leaf that Jamie and Heather got me. They also got me a Crate and Barrel gift card as a housewarming. So sweet. I've always wanted one of these plants, but then, I don't know, I've just never bit the bullet and bought one, but I'm super excited because I just feel like I definitely need more greenery in my apartment. Sorry, it's a little messy right now. We need to find a little home for this. I think I want to research online to see kind of like what type of lighting this needs and all of that because I definitely don't want to kill this little guy. He is so cute. Today is a big day because I'm actually dropping off my dad at the airport. He is finally going on his trip to Japan, so I'm excited to take him to his last meal in LA and then drop him off at the airport before he starts his big journey in Japan. Now, if you want to follow along his journey in Japan and kind of find out more about what he's doing, you can check out his website, shimazustudio.com, which I'll leave a link to down in the description box below. <laughs> With dad, we're at getting some burgers. For his last meal. Cheers. <laughs> All right, ready? <laughs> Cheers. Last meal. <laughs> last meal in America. <laughs> Ready for your trip? I'm ready. <laughs> All right, time to drop off this guy. <laughs> All ready to go. All ready to go. So I'm gonna drive him to LAX right now, and then he's gonna embark on his Japan journey. Ooh. 